This week, the Georgia legislature easily passed a religious liberty bill that makes it legal for faith-based groups to discriminate based on sexual orientation. This is 2016, and they've just taken us back to the 1800s. A coalition of 480 businesses have already shunned the bill, including Twitter, Apple, Coca-Cola, Google, Arby's, Home Depot, the Girl Scouts, and now the NFL. They're saying if the bill passes, they won't let Atlanta host the Super Bowl. And if the NFL says you're bad, you're probably bad. Religious liberty bills, or bills that let organizations use religion to discriminate, are nothing new. A lot of states have them. Like, a lot of states. Georgia's bill currently sits on Governor Nathan Deal's desk waiting for approval, or veto, by early May. A lot of businesses are urging him to reject the bill. Like, a lot of businesses. And now the NFL is telling Georgia, no Super Bowl for you. Which is particularly devastating when you realize that Atlanta's Mercedes-Benz Stadium, complete with a retractable hardtop roof, will cost Georgia $1.5 billion by the time it's completed in 2017. Georgia's booming film industry is also in jeopardy. Between 2014 and 2015, the nearly 250 film and TV productions shot in Georgia, including Ant-Man, The Hunger Games, and The Walking Dead, generated $6 billion in economic impact and created thousands of jobs. But the bill has summoned the industry ready to abandon the peach state. We're asking you to join us. To join us as we urge TV and film studios, directors and producers, to commit to locating no further productions in the state of Georgia if this bill becomes law. Same-sex marriage is the law of the land. But 30 states still don't ban job or housing-related discrimination based on sexual orientation or gender identity. So while Deal hopefully vetoes the Religious Liberty Bill, that really wouldn't do much to fix the lack of anti-discrimination or hate crime legislation in Georgia, a state that recently saw two gay men burned with scalding hot water while they slept. When I'm out in the sun, it hurts. Like, it's basically like you're being burned all over again. But for this bill in particular, when you have film buffs, jocks, Girl Scouts, and Cher all telling you to cut it out, cut it out. This is your mic check.